Alright, after working for like seven days straight on Hefker's E74, instead of getting a heat um, gun, I figured out that I can get a hair dryer. You know? And use the hair dryer on this thing. And right now it's burning hot. I've got to try to get it into its casing. Um, I used. I heated this one up. This one's really hot too. So along with this one right here. Um, and I heated those two up. And I heated the bottoms of them up too. And what that'll eventually do. Hopefully. Is um. Oh my god. These are hot as fuck. Ugh. for Christ's sake. Alright, those are in. That's in right there. Okay, um, now we're gonna go to the RF board. Um, that's gonna go in here. Um, any day now. Any time. Okay, R Ford's in after <laughs> not much time. Um Ah, uh, god damn it. Ugh. Such bullshit. God. Alright. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna heat this thing up here. You heat this part up here. That's one of the main problems with the E74 right there, is that's it's gonna program itself and they're gonna heat this piece right here. And as you see, hopefully you can get the camera up there. You know. Not too far up, I am as much as you can see. That's all I should take. That's hot. That's burning. Um, okay. Uh, Alright. Um, no, that's in. Okay. You should have all your, uh, you should have at least three of the main screws right here. Okay. I'm gonna go one here. Oh, that is freaking hot. Maybe I should have waited till after. And right, whatever. I'm gonna go solid there. You have another one here. And I actually looked on YouTube several times from other people on how to do this kind of shit, and pretty much they didn't really explain, they just like, oh, do this, this, and that, you know, and they didn't really explain really what to do, and they didn't take their time on it, they already had it pre-done, or they had ordered parts, and I figured out for after seven days of researching and attempting things on a another motherboard that I have um, that actually didn't work, I figured out that, you know what? Let's use this one out the heat dryer, and this one out the blow dryer, and uh, let's see if that can do anything. And luckily, on that other um, motherboard, it actually worked wonders, which is surprising. Okay, um, now with all my equipment of different parts of Xboxes and stuff over here, um, I might look for a fan. What I'm hoping is I probably don't have one over here. Uh, I bought an. I bought, oh, there's one right there. That's the old one. Okay. I'm gonna go over here for a second. I have another fan here. Uh, 
And uh, this is a brand new fan, actually. Just ordered it um, from Llama.com. Uh, you can get it too. I mean, it's not an LED one, but it's a really good working in condition fan, not dirty or anything. The one I pulled out of this one that I got from somebody actually was pretty damn dirty. When I opened up the Xbox on this one, all you saw was coming out of it was dust cracking out and spitting out of one end, and it looked so nasty. I was just disgusted. Here's the old fan, Dusty Cell. Brand new fan. Nice. Nice, good at working order. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to carry this over here. And, uh, anything you pretty much saw on that table there is all for sale. Please, uh, I need the money. And, uh, that would really help if you all would please maybe, uh, uh, take some of this stuff off my hands. I really need it gone. Bring in some new parts. And they are all new parts, though, but I mean, I meant, like, newer parts. Maybe some LEDs for my other Xboxes I'm doing. I'm recently just finished making on console mods. Uh, and... That went really well. Um, I had someone that was really excited with what I did and the work I did on it. Um, and when they when I gave it to him, they were pretty much crying. I mean, they were like, ah, ah, ah. when they saw like they not like a terrible cry or anything like that, but it was pretty funny. I laughed my ass off on the ground really hard. All right, so here's this fan. Okay, it's in now, perfectly brand new. Um, it has some minor minor difficulties uh, originally with the fan. Um, and that would, normally with the new 74 they would have you stick a bunch of screws or whatever the hell in there and that would only work they said the guy said it would work for three months well sorry sir it worked for two days fucked up terribly um came up with this method works beautifully works wonders none of that towel shit it's just some bullshit all right now um now that's in okay. uh what are you gonna need to do is you need to flip over your xbox well, technically, I'm not going to do this, but when you're going to flip over your Xbox, and you're going to see, um, right around here, you're going to be able to put, you need to put in, screw here, 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 um, who the fuck am I kidding, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, um, screws there. They're the little, I mean, the, the ones in the middle where the little black screws too, like the ones I put on the RF board, and, um, and then the other ones are like the little smaller silver screws, not the big ones that you take out to make the whole console open. Temporarily, um, I was going to try out this one because I still got to do some um, LED modifications, and, um, I'm going to put a JTAG in for this person, um, that's what they ordered, that's what they wanted, um, and I'm going to upsize the voltage on the fan. Uh, by connecting a red wire from here on the audio, I mean, not sorry, the, um, the AV cable, a slide all the way over through this hole here on the back end, right there, that the hole right there, it's going to slide through that hole, and it's going to reach back to the back way in the front right here, and it's going to make this from an 8 volt to a 12 volt um, fan, make it much better and more increased, that's like that, very easy stuff. Hey, um... And let me grab the drive for this, which is right here. It's a BenQ drive. So you can tell by this little tan thing right here. That's how you tell it's a BenQ drive most of the time. Uh, and the way it's shaped right here. Uh, very simple, easy. I use a lot of GTA modding for my BenQs. Mostly, I asked this is a flash drive that I just finished flashing. If you all want to have a flash drive, I can do that for you easy, simple, clean. Thanks. Um, and this thing too. I also mod these. I put I put little uh, screens right here on the inside of these, so you can see that's thing. It's no use, but it's pretty cool when you see the outlet of it. Um, so this is gonna go in there. Make sure it snaps in with the fan. Uh huh. And uh, once this pretty much snaps in with the fan, it should be good. And now here comes the menu. Thank you. Slides in perfectly. Actually, no shit. I am such a dumbass. Okay. Uh, I forgot the SATA cable. And I forgot the power cord for this one. Power cord goes in. So does uh, it, it, it won't read unless you have it the exact certain way. Um, and you can tell by the twist of the wire, the way it is. Um, it should help. It should look like this. The twist of the wire. So you like see it's pointing this way, so that you twist it up that way. And this other one back here is twisted up, so that you can put it in the drive. Um, very effective and useful in a way. I don't know why the hell I'm talking like this. Just because I'm trying to press people on the video camera, I guess. 
Maybe so. What I always do is I put the white cable in first. I mean, it makes a difference because that's the power cable, and then you put the SATA in. Um, where it frees off the console. Um. And now that's in. Okay. And it should sit down perfectly like this. Easy. Alright. Now. Um, here you go. I mean, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take, I'm going to carry this Xbox with the camera into the other room. Well, here's the other screws though, but in the other room. And we're going to test this out. And if I have a problem, then I don't know why the hell you just wasted uh, about 12 minutes uh, on the camera with me because I'm just such a dumbass if it doesn't work. Uh, okay, so let's do it. Ugh. Not missing anything, hopefully. I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to do, I'm going to put the uh, power cord in. It's just like a nice easy, but see, I didn't put the screws in for the motherboard, so I'm just going to try this. I'm going to put the thing in, the AV cable, Wi Fi. In, I catch it nice and easy. There's nothing underneath the on, so like I did my dumbass for doing that. Um, and if this doesn't work, then like I said, you wasted 12 minutes, which is I am completely stupid if you did. And you should just dislike this video or like it for how dumb I am. What's good, y'all? What's motherfucking good? What's motherfucking good? What's mother, 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 motherfucking good?